Okay, we bought these uh, and supposedly working, but wasn't working. Uh, and he was not calling at all. Like a really minimum. Uh, sure, well, he was slow on free and right. We went to uh, the store, bought this little thing over there, right there. Uh, it comes in this box. It was like, uh, I think it was 12, no, nah, not even that, like $9, no, huh, like $5, sorry, it was $5, and then we bought uh, a refrigerant, you can get it on AutoZone, Advance, uh, Walmart, anywhere, we just bought it on the same place that they got that, it was a little more expensive, but it was like a dollar or two more, I just got it in there, same place, then I got this adapter, on AutoZone, it's a uh, uh, focus. It's a uh, convert to R12 to R134A because the connector in here on, on this adapter, this one, it's a uh, R12, not uh, not R134A. That that's the refrigerant you're gonna need to use, right? Uh, it does say over here what you actually need, right? It's R134A Focus R134A R134A Retrofit to R134A on the valve this valve have a little needle that goes in the pipe makes a hole and then you can shoot the gas these from AutoZone or Advance, I don't remember. It even comes with a can. You can buy the can that has everything in there. Oops. Uh, you put it on this one over here that actually does the vacuum. If you can't, because this is really small, you can put it on the other one. You're gonna feel the one that gets normally cold. One gets hot, you wanna put it on the one that gets, gets cold. Uh, normally it's this one, uh, but my case i was able to put it in here you tie that thing it comes with uh, a couple comes with two of these different sizes one fit on this on this pipe whoops one fit on this pipe the other one fit on that other pipe it was a little bigger you put it on the back put these tight the screws turn these uh, clockwise uh, you don't have to make it too tight or anything then you go I think it's half turn or one turn it's on the instructions the, the ball comes with instructions tell you what to what to do and you put your can turn it on put your can spray it in slowly it's gonna take you 10 15 maybe 20 minutes you fill it up and you want these to be about two not even five pounds you shoot a little bit it's gonna go fill the line it's gonna go down and just wait and wait let it cycle and all that and then wait a little bit shoot a little bit more just go slowly don't overfill it and that's it after we did that now it's actually cooling it was on 68 almost 70 uh, and now I put it on the bottom one it's on 60 something no 50 something I can't read that it's too small uh, but I put it on the top one and on the top one actually reached 50 and it's on 51 it's set up to 51 the top one no the bottom one is 51 the top one is on 41 and it was doing 50 and I just fill it up like a couple minutes ago so it's uh, working that's all you gotta do